My name is Yijie Wang. I'm the Web Communication Specialist at Nadan Asia Media. So I specialize in web development and web design. I've been building a lot of websites for uh, individuals and business owners in the past. In this video, I'm going to talk about some effective tips to create a robust online presence through creating powerful web content. Let's get into it. In 2020, creating a website is not that hard. But creating powerful content can really deliver your message, deliver who you are and what your business is to your audience is challenging and difficult. So the first thing you have to do, you have to be um, extremely articulate about who you are and what your business is. Typically, the first part of a website needs to be a title. So if you have any experience with HTML or web development, you probably know H1 tag. So H1 tag is basically the title of a page or the title of the website. So it tells Google what this page is all about. So if you have like a really concise, clear message in your H1 tag, Google can instantly know um, if your page or your website is relevant to um, your audiences. For example, if you're a songwriter, you can just say, hey, uh, my name is William and I write beautiful songs. This is a really simple example. Or you're running a business, you can just say, hey, I'm running a media production company and I make videos for businesses and individuals. Simple as that. So it doesn't have to be really, really fancy and flushy. It needs to be really concise, needs to be uh, right on point so your audience wouldn't get confused. So at the first section of your website, you have your title. So normally it can be made in the form of um, some images uh, in the big slider, you can make it into a slideshow so it's more uh, visually appealing to your audience. So once your visitors open your website, they can see who you are and what your business is right away. So that can really make your visitor interested about your website and keep reading the rest of your website. So the second tip, also I personally think is the most powerful tip is creating blocks, quality blocks. So um, creating really quality blocks is really difficult for a lot of people because it takes time and energy to write, to write brilliant paragraphs. There's actually there are not many people are doing it because it's kind of challenging and it takes a lot of time. So if you can write blogs and write um, good content with a lot of keywords, you can really stand out and Google can really tell uh, you're making an effort to your website and to your online presence. Because the goal of Google is to offer the best content, best quality content to its users, right? Because Google is also a business. It always try to uh, show its user best content. So if you can really figure out the way to uh, write quality content uh, with keywords, um, you can really win on Google. So what type of blog should you write? You should always try to make people think you're an expert uh, at what you're good at. For example, you're, um, you're a software engineer. You can write blogs about uh, anything with um, technologies, uh, software development, so um, your readers can tell you're really an expert at what you're good at and they would trust you more because you offer value and quality content to your readers and they love it. So another powerful thing about creating blogs is people can find your blogs directly by searching what they want to search on Google. For example, you're running a cooking blog and your readers are really curious about how to cook certain type of food. So they can type it in Google, like how to cook uh, French cuisine, for example. And if your content is good enough, they can find your blogs from the search engine from Google. So um, they can cling to the blog and find out uh, who the author is, which is you, and to uh, find out who you are. And they can click to the homepage and to go over the whole website. So you can really attract your audience by creating powerful content so they can find you organically online. So once you create powerful blogs, there are going to be people who are starting to read your content. So the best thing you can do next is to have a mechanism to capture emails. So you don't want to waste your traffic. You don't want to waste people who are constantly visiting your website. So that's the reason it's better to have a section uh, in your website or your blog to capture emails. So the best thing about capturing emails is you're uh, actively creating a community. So if you're someone who is trying to build up a better online reputation, um, you can really start engaging with your audience by uh, capturing emails and send them uh, emails and updates constantly so they would know uh, what you're up to and they will be more likely to engage your content you make in the future. So if you're running a business, capturing email will be even more important. So you want to constantly put out content about your products, your services, 
uh, to make your customers long-term customers, make your customers your loyal fans. So not only they'll be really satisfied about their current purchases, they're more likely to refer your products and services, even who you are, to their friends, to their relatives. So you can expect your business to experience an exponential growth. So the last tip is um, creating video content for your brand and your personal website. Creating video is probably the most engaging and effective way to uh, win people's trust. Because you're putting yourself out there to talk in front of camera, you're showing who you are and uh, what your character is. And people love it. People love authenticity. Um, in 2020, where creating media content is extremely easy, if you can really um, show your authentic self to your visitors, to your audience, you can really stand out. So when people hear your voice and see your face, they're more likely to trust you, to trust your product, um, which leads to better online presence and better online reputation. So you want to make as many videos as possible and put yourself out there, stepping out of comfort zone and talking in front of camera. Because making videos is really scary for a lot of people. A lot of people, they, they're really afraid of putting themselves out there, talking in front of the camera because they, they're shy and uh, they lack the skill to present themselves. So if you can spend a little bit of time to practice, to get yourself more comfortable with camera and talking in front of camera, you can really stand out because there are not so many people who are making a lot of videos. So once you start making videos, you can start linking all your content together. You can link your website under your YouTube description box if you're uploading your videos on YouTube. Google owns YouTube. People are doing a lot of searches on YouTube every single day. So if you're actively putting out content on YouTube, not only um, people on your website can see more videos about you, they can also find you on YouTube. All of these can bring you more traffic and more attraction. Even from a web design standpoint, if people can find different type of content on your website, they can find not only beautiful pictures, quality blogs, but also videos that can really make a big difference. Here you have it, the four tips you can start implementing today to build up a robust online presence. Um, I know that can be a little bit scary and challenging, you know, start writing blogs and start making videos, but the key thing is to start doing. You can't do anything by just purely thinking about it, right? You have to start stepping out of your comfort zone and start producing content right away. So this is today's video, hopefully you enjoyed it. You can expect to see more videos like this on the channel about you know having a better online reputation, better online presence, and building up a powerful brand. So if you like this video, be sure to click the like button and turn the notification on. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Be sure to subscribe to the channel and to see more updates in the future.